So, hey guys, this is Mike, the wrestling guy. So I'm sorry, I'm not going into the intro because I am going to talk about Raw because I did see it last night. And what I and this is the thing I've been looking online. I don't usually look on the Twitter feed. I don't really look at like I look at um Sean Ross app stuff. I look at Wrestle Talk. Like here's what I think is gonna happen with this Cody Rock Roman situation is I rather wait a next year to get Roman and Rock instead of getting it this year because here's the thing I understand he wants that WrestleMania match. And here's the here's the thing, and I thought about it too, because like Stephen Larson gave up a great point last night when I watched their video. This dude's only doing this because he's the majority shareholder of TKO. That's why, like he, like, and I, I respect the Rock as a wrestler, but as a person, I'm like, bro, you you kind of just screwed everybody. Like, here's my thing. I think we're going to get the Roman versus Cody thing because we've been waiting it for it for three years. I don't want to be waiting for it at that next WrestleMania. Oh, we're finally gonna get it. No, it's not going to feel as good. It's not going to feel good. It's going to feel like a waste of time. Like, it's going to feel like a waste of time. Like, even last night when I saw the promo, like the promo that went hit, but, but Drew and Seth, I'd rather see Drew and Seth go for the world title than, than, than Punk, than Cody, Drew, and Seth going for that, like going against Seth for the world title. It doesn't make sense for him. He doesn't want that title. He wants the universal title. That's what he wants. And I'm saying, like, bro, he should fight for that title. He should make it a triple threat or say, yo, I'm going to cash in on my WrestleMania thing because I still owe it and I still have it. I can still use it. And this is what I'm saying. If they want to do Rock and Roman, do it next year, bro. Do it for when we're ready. Not like when we just got through a year of Cody. Let, let Cody have his reign. And I'm going to say this because here's the thing. As a fan, I look, and this is the thing, we got so many Rocky Suck chants last night, because I heard them, and the joke is, they know this is crap, like, we booed it, like, bro, when has anybody booed anything? And the joke is, like, we've seen it, we, we know what TKO is doing, and this is the problem, because of the Vince thing, because they're becoming under federal investigation, I'm like, bro, you need to give us this match to a lead, because nobody's gonna buy the tickets then. Then the pre-show is not even worth... Then the pay-per-view itself is not even worth seeing because... Oh. And the thing is, I don't mind them doing whatever they're doing. But when it comes to Cody Rhodes, and I'm like, bro, he deserves that shot more than Rock does. Rock just walked in. I get that they're trying to do another Rock John Cena thing, but that's the problem. I don't see... And the joke is, I don't see a Daniel Bryan situation in this. I don't. Like Jesus, I don't. I don't see a a, a a Daniel. I don't see a Daniel Bryan situation in this. I don't because the problem is, is like, bro, the fact that they knew this was gonna happen. Like WWE has been going through a lot of turmoil and a lot of bullshit because of Vince. And I'm like, dude, I like in my thing, the matches were great, but all through the match, all the stuff I've been hearing is the Cody thing, and the and even the announce, like even the color commenters were talking, even Michael Cole and Pat McAfee were talking about it. Cody couldn't even get a word in edgewise because they because Seth is so busy on Drew. Drew is so busy on Seth. And the funny thing, they had a fight. Knowing I'd rather him go against Roman and beat the crap out of him and let him have the belt because the joke is they want to do Tribal Chief against Tribal Chief, which would work. But just not now. He's not going to come. He's, he's going to be a part-time in it. It's going to be a Brock Lesnar thing. And and, and and the thing is, I get what they're trying to do with the TKO, the, the business partnership. I get it, Nick Khan and all these other dudes. But I'm like, bro, Trips doesn't want this. Cody should be like, yo, listen, Trips, I want my match. Like, I want my match at WrestleMania. I want it booked. Let's keep doing the story that I'm in. I'm the head. Of, I'm the face of the company. I'm the face of the, 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 the 2K game. Let's do this shit. Because and to me, as a fan, I'm like, bro, this is this, this is what you would do. This is what you would do in 2000. Like, you did this to Daniel Bryan. You, I mean, you did this to CM Punk when he won his shot. You brought The Rock in. And you're bringing The Rock in for what? Because of the simple fact that well, he's a drug. Yeah, we know this dude's a box office drug. We get it. But and, and as a fan, I'm like, bro, this is why like nobody wants to deal with him anymore. We don't think about the right. That's the thing about the rock. This dude has enough money. He retired from wrestling. 
officially retired from wrestling. And he won't say he did. And he did. And that's the thing. He's going to do a once a year thing that he comes out. Bro, we know you come out. We get it. We know you, Rock. And I think him being in DC try when he tried to when he tried to to pull his to pull his weight or to throw his weight around and he literally was like, Oh, I wanna make Black Adam a thing. I wanna make Black Adam get more recognition. I wanna be more recognized for that. Bro, that's why you got but they got rid of you in DC. Cause it didn't work. It didn't work for you. It didn't work for you because the joke is you 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 knew it wasn't gonna work for you. So you thought if you go to WWE, which you had which you have diplomatic immunity in. And I think if Trip like if Chips wanted to be CEO of of, of 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 Endeavor, he could do that because he is Vince's like son in law. And I think he should just I really think he should be. Just so he can call the shots and say, Look, Rock, we don't need you. Like, thank you for coming, but we don't need your services. Thank you. Because, like I said, everything was great. Like, all the matches were great. Like, the match we had with the tag team, the, 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 um, the Fatal 4-Way match that we had with DIY, that's even great. I even like the, the, like, the, the, the Judgment Day getting better with themselves and r Truth being funny. That was cool. Even the match we had with the Kabuki Warriors against, um, Kachana Chance and, 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 and um, and Katie Carter was cool. That was cool. But the Kabuki Warriors are not going to lose those belts on Raw. I mean, come on now. And I like this. I like what they're doing with the damage control stuff. They did great with that. But I'll wait till Thursday, guys. But all in all, Raw was good. Um, I give it like a solid 9 out of 10 because, like, because the crowd wasn't, we're not listening. Like, bro, we don't want to go through this anymore. We're not going to care. We, we won't buy the game. Just give us the special guest referee thing and get done. That's it. So we can have our match at WrestleMania. So we can get through the Elimination Chamber. Because I'm like, bro, if they want to give it to him in Elimination Chamber, he'll, he'll take a shot there, which I really think he shouldn't. Then fine. Because that's the point. Why are we giving six, like, like John Cena said, why are we giving fifth and sixth chances to dudes who don't want to be in this thing? The Rock shows up every bloody year. He was the host for WrestleMania for one time. And then when they did the thing with Rock, the first, the Rock for Cena, the first fight they had, he didn't win. He lost. So to me, I think, like at this point, bro, we don't want the Rock. We will wait next year, bro. We will wait because we don't want it. We don't want it. And I'm like, bro, with this TKO, like, I don't know. That's what I'm hoping. If Cody gets his shot and he finally gets the title, I want him to have the WWE title. I don't want him to have the World Heavyweight title. The World Heavyweight title is meaningless to me. It's it's making the belt. They're making the world hard. Like, he's, Seth is doing a great job with that belt, but not as good as Gunther. Not as good as Gunther with the Intercontinental. Because Intercontinental belt, he's making that belt the workhorse title. Logan Paul is making it like the belt with the workhorse title. They're trying with him. And whether they want to believe that and they're making the woman like they're making the WWE Women's Champion actually make a lot of sense because the joke is I'd rather be a women's world champ the women's champion than the women's world champion because there's nobody that can really go against Rhea except for Becky. And the joke is even if they let her go against her and she she wins the spot at Elimination Chamber. It's already a foregone conclusion that Rhea is coming out of WrestleMania top dog. Because that's how I see it. Rhea's already getting a match against Nia, and I feel like, girl, that's a waste of time because she's going to beat Nia. She's going to beat Nia. Because they're going to do something with Jay Cargill where she's going to come in, but she probably won't come in until after WrestleMania because they got to get the WrestleMania stuff out. And, if, and, if, and if I think about it. If Jade would have won, she probably would have went after Rhea. She probably would have went after Io. She would have went after Rhea, but I think she would have won. She, I think she would have wanted to go after Rhea because Rhea, as a, because she would have went after Rhea. She would have had a, a fight with um with Jade because I'm hoping they do something with Jade at some point. 
And I'm hoping, like, because I love the fact that we have, like, Naomi. And I love that the fact that they all have um, camaraderie, which is really good to me because they're doing amazingly well. But, like I said, anyway, um, like, comment, subscribe. But all in all, guys, it was good. Um, But all in all... I will be giving you a review on Thursday what I think about the press conference and what we got so far on that. I'll probably do that on Thursday. But anyway, guys, like, comment, subscribe. Peace.